One month. One month. One, one month, four days. And you, you took the two, two weeks. No, no, from uh, Switzerland. Traffic. No, from one. Berlin. No, no. The first I was in Berlin. Yeah. I go back to the train to Switzerland, and I worked the last ten years. I work in Switzerland. Oh. Yes. I see. It was good for my rent, you know. Yeah, of and course. It, and this is a ground that we need to. I want to. Uh, and the travel, the travel. You said you started in the Berlin or, 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 or at the wedding. Oh, so it took two weeks from the Switzerland. Was a bike? Yes. Four days. Four days? Yes. <laughs> I won't go outside. I won't go. I won't go. I have a ticket for from Barcelona. Barcelona. And I started uh, on Thursday morning. Oh, so you took a train? No, no, it was a bike. From which city in Switzerland? Yes, and that there, there you started your trip. Yes. Okay, okay. I thought that you started in Berlin. No, no. Okay. I'm in, Berlin, in Berlin, I say goodbye my family. Oh yeah, I see it now. It was my start. Yes, yes, yes. It was my start. And I go with the travel with the train to and from Kuo before I clean my room, my house, and then goodbye. Adios. And also in Berlin was my start. Oh yes, okay. We are about 500 meters further towards Tangier and we are waiting by the road for our friend Jonas who stopped at the mechanic because he has some uh, car failure so he is there somewhere a little bit back we we'll wait for him I think he invited us for lunch for supper probably the supper it is uh, six o'clock now and yes, we are in Morocco!
We are, ladies and gentlemen, very close to the edge of the world. The guy is Mustafa. He went back to the city. There is the city. And he lives in the middle of nowhere. And I like it. Yeah. It's peaceful. Quite simple. With a nice touch of improvisation. So, I'm thinking about staying here for a few days until those nasty clouds all around disappear and then we shall continue. And to tell you my first impression, uh, immediately after we landed, that is, left the ship, the, the guy on the, the policeman on the on the border well he stamped my uh, document my passport and he charged me five euros okay so i gave him 10 euros and he said no change and next thing he said okay this will be for you and your friend my friend is our friend hans which we already lost immediately after that because he went on the ferry to cadiz while I went further along the Moroccan coast. And it is raining day after day, so... <laughs> I changed my clothes. I feel better now, but I've been wet for two days, like totally wet. Rain, rain, rain. And Mustafa's dogs. We are in the town of Asilah. And like I said, at the edge of the world. I will take this as a very good omen because it is a double rainbow. Mustafa has got a solar panel. I love the tiles again. My bedroom and video studio. We are rendering and charging at the same time. And uh, both the computer and uh, of course the machine. I will take a much needed nap. The guy is a cheating bastard and honestly I didn't expect anything else. Uh, a few days ago he took 300 dirhams and won 10 euros from me and said I will give you, I will bring you internet data, 30 gigabytes, 30 for you my friend and it turned out I don't have internet, I do have a telephone like messages and calling in Morocco and now just a few minutes ago he wanted 270 dirhams from me more to borrow him Thank mm -hmm. you. 